with the ignatic with the enigmatic trapper and traitor are now bleeding in the snow you persisted you could see a light in the distance the end is near we would need another man i'm gonna go ahead and cut that chase go ahead and like and subscribe because you can't to the right places neon a person welcome back to inscription uh last time we basically got one of the best cards in the game freak man i and then i forget you're, there's something you're supposed to do out here but i forget what it is Arg! the pain is unbearable even after all these years what do you want i have very little to live for these days may that dagger find its mark you must be brave I have to use the dagger? Is that something that I'm supposed to do? Arg! Watching the angler lose. Now that soothed my pain. An old rival of mine, that fisherman. He bested me this time, but I will have another chance. Oh, maybe I use him during the angler fight? Is that something that I have to do? The clock stuff isn't in this book, right? Cause I, I think I have to get that clock open, but I forget why. Shoot. Okay. Wait, th this is the end, isn't it? Well, how many items do I have? Oh, I have the dagger, the hook and bones. Do I have any pelts in my deck? Is there a way that I can see that? Wait, no, altered. Oh, I, apparently I can. Let's go for the safe bet and do a sacrifice. Because getting rid of more cards inside of my hand is always a good thing. Because then I could draw more later. So we got his attack up to 11. Hmm. Ooh. What if we put, oh shoot, I know what I was gonna do. I know what my plan was. It was to do this. <laughs> Wait, should I do this though? I don't, Ouroboros does not need to be more powerful. Oh my gosh, bro, this is so stupid. I'm gonna, am I gonna do it? This has three health. This could be a decent card. And I think I have Undying Squirrels this run, right? It's been a minute since I played. Strange Larva is actually a good card. Hack Rat on Skink is another combo that I think could have been pretty good. Oh, Breaking Tail on Ouroboros could be crazy as well. Because I already have a crazy Skink, don't I? These, these are my two ideas. The Trip Attack could come in handy. Like just in case we need to rely on the Mantis for anything. The Skink card could come in handy. Either way is is good. Let's go for this kink. Guys have fixed themselves on the small cabin. It's warm light, a beacon in the oppressive darkness of the night. Surely, surely this cabin marked the end of your tra travels. Uh. Go. Oh. What is this? Oh, steps away from the strange cabin, you were presented with an opportunity. Oh, the clock says eleven. Don't offer my boons to. I don't offer my boons to just any traveler. If you are able to pass my trials, you will be rewarded mightily. A trial of the swift. Trial of the winged, trial of the skins, freak. I have one swift card. I don't remember how many flyers I have. And I don't think I have any skins. Oh gosh, do I have many flyers? I just looked at it, bro. I don't think I do. Please pull it. Oh, yes. Ah, oh, coin is a card with the sprinter sigil. Success. Let's go. I will grant you one of my most powerful boons. Cards that dramatically alter the game and you don't even need to draw them. Uh, boon of blo goat's blood. You will start a battle with a goat uh, on your field. You will start a battle with eight bones. You will start a battle with great ferns on all of your spaces. That sounds kind of terrible. Let's go for the bones. We'll repeat that once more. Trial of the ring. If you have a ring, you pass automatically. Trial of the Red Tea. Three cards must include a rare card. And Trial of the Fend. Well, obviously the rarity. I think most of my deck is rare. Yeah. Good fortune. Ah, the Gek is a rare card. Success. A trio choice of boons. 
A boon of magpie's eye. When you draw from your deck, you may choose any card in your deck to draw. Eee. Boon of the forest, you'll start a battle with great friend. I don't want that one. And boon of the ghost blood. Magpie's eye. Every single time. Because now I can just pull whatever card I need from my hand. You managed to get both of my boons. I rarely say this, but I'm impressed. You have been a worthy adversary, but unfortunately I must soon put you to death. I'd like to see you try. I can't, oh. Oh yeah, you're a tree man. <laughs> you took your time out there. I'm itching for another game. Are you ready to play? No, no I'm not ready to, oh I guess I have no other option. I hope you are adequately prepared. Ooh, da, 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 da. Perhaps one more to be safe. You just give yourself an extra life. Tree man. Man of the trees. Undying squirrel. Lucky draw. Do, 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 do. Yeah. Do, 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 do. How do I want to play this first hand? What is he about to amalgam? A 3-3. Three, three. Do I have anything that can take that? Well, let's play Greater Smoke. Let's play the Gek. I think Gek will attack first, then Greater Smoke will do, will attack, which will block Amalgam from coming down, which I think is perfect. Boom, boom. And now they don't move. Oh no. Freak. He does switch between the guys that he's using. Okay, well, let's go for Skink right away. Shoot. He's gonna do that and he's gonna mine my cards. So both of those are dead pretty much. Also, it means that Amalgam still is not is still not gonna be able to come down. Don't I have to use this dagger for something? Yeah, see. Both of those are done. Good thing I guess his Mantis isn't going to be able to do anything though. Maybe I just go ahead and end this. I don't know if he, if he keeps doing this or if he, oh, I did have spell cards. I'm kind of glad I didn't do it though. I'm curious to see what that dagger does. To the user, you will place a weight on the scales. The pain is temporary. Right, well, let's play Skink. Place a weight on the scales. Oh! Oh! That's my eyeball! I forgot that that is what that does. Ouch! He's gonna take the nugget. Oh, shoot. He. I forgot. Oh no, I forgot about that turn. I forgot what that turn means. Shoot. Okay, well, it's fine. Because I'm about to draw this card. And then after I... Oh wait, no, I can't. I can't. I can't actually. I have to pull a squirrel. So he'll take this. Shoot. Dun, 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 dun. He's not close to winning yet. So it's fine that he takes that. Just to get that amalgam out of here. That's actually a really powerful card. Let's pull some more powerful stuff. Uh, like my mantis. Bing, bing. What is she gonna do? Is that a freaking Urayuli? Don't worry, this turn is over. Let me pull another squirrel just in case. What's he gonna play now? You capably endured the onslaught of rare creatures, but the true challenge was forthcoming. Shadowy figures appeared before you. In their eyes glimmered a recollection, recon, recognition of kinship, but colored by guilt, they were betraying you. Who is Kaminsky? And who is that over there? I remember that one fondly. Is that freaking 
Death Snapper? How dare you, Death Snapper? Maybe I should have. Maybe I should have made Ouroboros the most powerful card that ever existed. No, stop draw. Okay. Yep. You know, fair enough. The choice is yours. Uh, I choose you, Ashley Stinkbug. Great draw. Uh, I think that was a pretty good play. Although Death Snapper is gonna come down and take out Skink, but it kinda doesn't matter. Trade for what you can, but know this, the rest will stay and fight for me. Uh, I'm gonna need everything. Well, how many posts do I have? Oh, I only have one inside my hand. Well, it doesn't matter that that Sparrow is there. He can't do any damage. Let's take his Raven. Is that another Death Snapper? Who is that? Lewis? Who is Lewis? What's that Louise? Do I have anybody else I could play? I could play Reginald. That would get rid of Death Snapper. Yeah, sure. Let's play Reginald there. Oh my gosh. Bro, with this pickaxe thing. All right, one, two. Okay, so that's not enough to end a turn, but I can make it enough. Dude, I don't have too many attacking spots. Okay, draw a card. Yep, you know, you attack for three. Okay, so we'll do this and this. We'll play the wolf here. And then we play skink. Boom, and that's enough. Yup, yup, I'm with it. You like that? This danged moon is dramatic, yes. But it, but it provides no value to my board, I wonder. What? He played the moon? <laughs> no, that is value. What is, what is this? Omni strike. Oh, it strikes everything. What is title lock at the beginning of the onus turn a card bearing this sigil will pull small creatures like squirrels into orbit and also has mighty leap wait what if i just hook your moon can i not use that let me see not now there's nothing that can be hooked i can hook the moon <laughs> you liar <laughs> okay whatever Ouroboros is just gonna win this anyway and you're already stinky, so you can't even um can't even do nothing with your moon. Your moon serves no purpose here. Look, check this out. Bing, 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 bing. What's this weakening my moon with the stinky sigil? It makes no sense. Moons do not have the sense of smell. <laughs> this is not how I imagined this battle going. Well, I'm sorry, but that's it's just how the cookie crumbles. Let's see. Do, can I do more damage? Nah, not really. This is probably the best set that I could play. Wait, Death Snapper's in my hand. How did Death Snapper betray me? You really destroyed the moon. <laughs> I suppose all this left is to finish me off. Go on. Yep, you like that? That was all my bone coins. Oh my, did I just, I think I just made him. Oh. Yep. What the? Oh yeah. We're not playing this game as, as us. We're playing this game as this guy. Hey there card gamers, I'm the Lucky Carter and this is another pack opening video. Today I am opening Catch Monsters packs and digging for that oh, epic word. shiny Transcend Dog! Transcend Dog! Okay ladies and gentlemen, See, I add visual effects with lightning bolts? I don't know how to do that. What do we got here? Okay, and our first rare is a Urgent. Wow, good shot! Not exactly a viable competitive card, but hey, it's a pretty one. All right. Next pack. Next pack. 
feel yep. even better about this one. Bert. I gotta say, these cards are feeling extra silky today. I mean, they're so smooth. Dead. I'm not sure what they're doing down there at the uh, the card factory, but um, these are feeling good in my hands. That's hey, filler yo. commentary. Okay. <laughs> Let's see what we got here. Some jank cards. Maybe a few additions to my draft cube. We'll see. And our rare for this pack is... Bandog! What the dog doing? Not exactly riveting so far, but we have many packs to go. Next pack, here we come! That's all we're reading, Tom. Just cut out this part. Mmm. Hey there, card gamers. I'm the Lucky Carter, and this is a vintage pack opening video. Yay! Today I'm opening a few super rare old packs I snagged at a garage sale. What? I've got four packs of inscription. Oh. You would not believe the deal I got on these. Name drop. Well, not all of you will even remember this game. I'm barely old enough to have uh, seen these going around in my childhood. Uh, for whatever reason, they only did one set of these cards and then stopped printing them. There's not a huge market for them anymore, but. At the rate I got them for, there's not really much to lose. That being said, a foil mantis god goes for a couple hundred bucks. So. Oh dang. Fingers crossed. Really cool art on these. You're Got not gonna show it. And our rare for this pack is blue mage. Blue mage. Cool looking card, but not going to be worth very much. All right. Let's see what we got going on in the second pack. Huh. Uh, this pack has been opened and resealed. Hope no one snuck the rare out of it. That would suck. Come on, people, honestly. Who opens and reseals a pack? Huh. There's a set of coordinates on this card. Mm. Looks like they were drawn on with a pen. 49 degrees north, 123 degrees west. Uh, I think I'd have to check, but I think that's pretty nearby. How do you know that off the top of your head? All right, you guys. I'm out here living my best life. <laughs> Got my trusty headlamp and shovel. Always come prepared, kids. All right. Whew. There we go. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Whew. Getting close. I think. Assuming there is a thing to get close to. This very well may be a massive Waste of oh. Corrupted footage. All right. That's why this you always bring an extra battery. Boy. This is kind of unsettling. Every time. You got to come prepared. It reminds me of this game from back in the day called Simulacra. This is it. And now we dig. It's not how you dig, bro. Oh, what? I give a 75% chance it's a rock. But only one way to find out. Sound it hollow on the inside, though. is that oh my god you guys i can't believe it there's actually something here <sighs> better double check you're not digging up somebody's coffin What? 
guys. Are you seeing this? I'm uh I'm a little confused. Why was he running like that? <laughs> Figure out what's on this thing. That's what he said in the beginning. That's the startup screen. He can't start a new game either. Wait, so who started the first new game then? How do I get out of here? One of my eyeballs is still gone. Can I get that back, please? I do not celebrate often. I will seldom give gifts. But you, Challenger, you are worthy. Please do not be polite. Dig in. I can't eat it. Oh, is there something wrong? Your prize awaits. Very well. Come with me. I don't think I would want to eat that anyway, though. Stand right there. One of my eyeballs is still going. Can I get that back? Got mushrooms in your beard. Oh, am I taking a picture of you this time? Please do not be foolish. There's no film in there. I would need that. No! You, Challenger, are a champion, and I wish to commemorate your victory. Please inscribe your name. Uh. Winner. Shh. Do not despair. You are a winner. Ah, freak. How is this game not over yet? Wow. Did you pray today? Did you pray today? I'm gonna have to stop. Where does Friday come from? I beg your pardon. Oh! <laughs> <laughs>